Please don't die. 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 Good. Oh yeah, Britney Spears like getting gang banged by a bunch of white men. So my goal is to get 6 to 6 magic. Uh, I need to get 59 woodcutting and 49 fire making for lunar diplomacy. These tree spirits drop a lot of nature runes as well as the adamant axe that I really want. I don't really care too much about rune. Adamant and rune are quite the same on like an oak tree which would probably be the best method for training up until about 45 and then willows up until about 60 which I only need 55. Adamant would be the best. If I get rune beforehand I won't be I won't complain at all. And would you look at that we got the rune axe on the first drop. <laughs> One out of 128 chance. That's that's very very good RNG. <laughs> Probably the best RNG I've gotten on this account so far. Wow, I got my adamant axe on my fifth kill. <laughs> I think this place is actually quite suitable. Two trees, oak trees, and willow trees. Hopefully we don't see any people just coming up, killing me. All right. Um. Wow, a lot of high players. And I just got a pineapple seed. I don't think I'm going to be able to get 40 or 51 farming before uh, I die. So unfortunately, going to have to drop that. It's not worth anything in the general store either. So right now, I'm just going to do oak logs until about 45 wood cutting. That's when the willows start becoming better. Up until around 60, which I'm only going to get 55. So hey, 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 look what we got here. Sarah Diamond Bird pet garbage. Bird nest number four. We got acorn. Woo, I can definitely do something with this. Bird nest number five. Apple tree seed. Okay, okay. I might be able to use that later. I think I need 33 for that. Oh, 27. Cool shit. All right. Just got 41 wood cutting. Now I can use my great rune axe. And I just missed the bird's nest. God damn it. I think this is bird nest number seven. And we got the palm tree seed. That's really fucking rare, actually. And 21, 26.1k. <laughs> it took Barstad three hours to find me, and I had to tell him where I was because <laughs> he was about to go and leave. <laughs> Must have been really fucking bored. Great. He dropped some Bando's pages right in front of me and had to go. <laughs> Bye, I guess. <laughs> Alright, so I got the 50 fire making. Um, I decided not to waste more time on fire making and wood cutting. So what I plan on doing is I'm going to actually like train wood cutting and construction at the same time. So I'm going to need to get the Varrock balloon method, which only requires one willow log, which there are willow logs in, in Trana. But first, let me get this two seeds done out of the way. I uh, just saw level 59 in Catherby Bank. Hopefully he didn't see me. I'm going to just go over here and try to make sure I'm not dead. This is actually the first time I'm farming. I'm level 29, which is a little bit odd. So right now I'm going to be doing the Lost Tribe and finishing Death of Dorishkans so I can go steal a Bullseye Lantern for the Lunar Diplomacy as well as the Tears of Guthix quest, which will push me to 36 crafting, which will push me to the point where I can do the balloon transport method that I was thinking of doing, which I need to get at least 55 wood cutting. I think I'm only going to get 55 because I really don't want to get past 50 construction uh, without getting a decent money making method. I mean, blackjacking is good enough, but you know what I mean. Hopefully I don't get rushed while I'm talking to these NPCs. Kind of keeping a close eye. So I need to go to the library in Varrock, but I really prefer not to teleport to Varrock since I've had so many bad experiences in that Varrock square. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to just teleport to Edgeville and kind of just run around the whole Grand Exchange. Hopefully nobody catches on that I'm <laughs> going over there. Please don't attack me. I'm not for sale. Come on. Come on. Come on. Bye. Just gonna stay here on the border. Hopefully nobody sees me. I can't even see them, so I think we're good. <laughs> Goblin Village is quite infamous for the splashing community, so I do need to do need to get out of here pretty quickly. I always like this fist bumping emote. <laughs> uh, look at that ugly motherfucker. You too, Brittany. Put on some makeup, you slut. Soon you will all be destroyed. <laughs> Woo, mining XP, just what I need. Ooh, I got a ring of life. So I confirmed I can do every easy clue scroll, but uh, unless I need a coif. So what I'm going to do is if I need a coif, um, I'm going to have to drop that easy clue scroll. I need to get two ham sets, which is quite a lot. 
but since I don't have a lot of armor on, uh, I think I can do it. Trapping this little girl in the corner while I touch her back. Wow, I'm getting the best RNG right now. <laughs> like, no duplicates. This account's really, really lucky. So I'm getting really good RNG. I only spent about maybe 10 or 15 minutes now so far getting two sets, but I just need one hood and I would like to do my first easy clue scroll, but it may not happen. Let's see. Hi, Morgan Freeman here. This is when RNG Jesus decides to completely fuck over old PvP. Let's watch. I like how this girl is sitting here frustrating and yelling and kicking at me, but nobody is doing anything about it. <laughs> uh, it's been like 25 minutes. I still can't get my second hood. <laughs> and no easy clue scroll. Like, what the heck, man? Yay, first easy clue scroll. Let's do this. It's gonna really, really suck if I die. The problem with uh, any kind of clue scroll is I'm a complete noob to it, so I need to figure out where to get these leather gloves and boots. <laughs> Time to die, noob. Yeah, you like that, huh? Those fucking splashes, huh? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm such a noob. I read Equip a Desert Skirt, not a shirt. So, <laughs> noob. Feel free to call me a noob in the comments below. Oh, wow, only two steps. And I already got the, ooh, Armadal page. And Amulet of Magic, yay. That's actually pretty good. Too bad I'm going to lose this Armadal page, but I might as well go get a looting bag right now so I can go put some stuff in there. So what I plan on doing is I'm going to just use this looting bag just for things like, for things that I need to use like later, so like loot. So I've been pickpocketing for a whole hour now, trying to get this ham hood. It's really frustrating. I'm getting every single piece like four or five times but this fucking hood. Uh, just when I thought my RNG was getting really good. And there's a player here. Two players here. I'm just gonna log out. You guys have fun trying to butt fuck me. Whatever. Uh, it's been one hour of thieving. I have not gotten my hood but I got another clue scroll so let's go do that. Oh hey look at that. I got a black wizard robe g and guthic's robe legs that's cool all right third clue scroll i really hope i get this 44 46 construction prior to me dying because i do have the wizard robe and the guthic's robe legs i do want to keep i don't know how the costume worm works but i think it's per piece if i remember correctly if not we'll just keep the google doc and uh you guys will enjoy it from that point on i guess and we got some garbage loot Woo. And we got the fourth clue scroll. Not getting my fucking helm. Not getting my fucking hood. By the way, guys, you can sell these ham cloaks and all this ham stuff for like a lot of money, like 5k to 25k. Pretty decent cash, especially if you're going for like easy clue scrolls. I don't know. And if the item doesn't sell, you just put it, keep it in the GE for whatever price you want, and eventually it sells. So, yay, more garbage. Oh my god. After two hours of pickpocketing, not including the time that I was doing easy clue scrolls. We've finally gotten the ham hood. Oh, it's exciting! Thank you, Arn Jesus, for fucking me over today. Oh my god, you guys, Xanik watches my videos! Ah, uh, I would replace every word they say with goblins and put black people, but I think... That'd be kind of mean. Oh, they may say they're civilized, but they're still goblins. You can't trust them. The only reason that they're not a threat is because they're so stupid. So, this is the surface. Yep. Players killing each other. <laughs> it's a big fucking war up here. That's the sun. Where's the fucking sun? And why are the walls black as shit? <laughs> There's no sun. They did a great job with the dialogue in this quest, though. Thousands of years ago, the gods made our ancestors fight in horrible wars. It was only after we escaped from them that we were b able to build a civilization. Ah, I think Chagux is hinting something here. Wow, that's awfully rude of you, Bob. Wow. You tell him, Xanik. 360 no scoped. Headshot. How come Xanik gets fingers and we don't? Well, it looks like uh, we decapitated Xanik for some reason. <laughs> Tell me a story. Xanik is dead! <laughs> Xanik's just tired, everybody. Come on, he's not dead. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? That you're ugly as hell? Oh, baby, a triple! 
I remember so many bugs of some guy stealing these crates and <laughs> bringing in the GE and stuff like that. <laughs> this guard's stuck behind the crate. Oh dang, I just hit 41 strength and 58 combat. Better get magic up. <laughs> Yay, now I can go steal a bullseye lantern, which is the original reason why I started this quest. Got 1 to 13 range. Okay, that's, that's nice. Hey. Hey you. Yeah, you. The one with the face and the f the hair. Make sure to click subscribe. I know you enjoyed it because you watched over 10 minutes of it. Come on, do it.